Video editing can be a complex, arduous task, and sure, sometimes all of those crazy transitions and edits are necessary. But what if you just want to edit a simple talking head video like this with animated captions and B-roll without getting lost in a sea of complicated editing software? The best tool I've found for an edit like this is a web-based software called Riverside. Now, Riverside is sponsoring this video, so they gave me a discount code to share with you guys. I put that down in the description. You'll also find with that a link for a free trial so that you can experience this type of editing for yourself. You can either record natively in the application using your phone or your webcam, or you can upload a previously recorded video. For this example, I'm gonna use one of those videos that I shot separately. Once you upload the unedited clip, you'll find that it automatically creates a transcription of the audio, and we'll be able to use this later on to edit the actual video. The first thing that you'll wanna do though is get the basic edit done which simply means removing all of the silences. All you have to do to remove the silences from your clip are click this AI producer button right up over here, then hit select pace, choose how fast you want the video to be, and the AI will do the rest of the work for you. From there, you can cut out any additional recording mistakes by simply selecting and deleting those words from the transcription. Finally, if you're like me and you say, um, a lot, go over here and apply smooth speech. This will tell the AI to remove any filler words like like or um, and it'll make your presentation flow a lot better. Of course, the AI might miss something here or there, so we'll finish up this core edit with a little bit of manual adjustments using the super simple timeline near the bottom of the screen. Now that our core video is edited up, let's add some polish to it. The first thing I do at this point is add some background music to keep the video a little bit more interesting. There's a bunch of royalty-free options included with Riverside that you can select and use in your project, or if you want to source your music from a different site, you can upload your own tracks right here at the top. Once you've picked your music, it will append right below your main audio track and you can move it anywhere you want and adjust the length. Next, go ahead and adjust the volume to whatever sounds right. This is gonna vary depending upon the background track, but you wanna make sure that your vocals or your, your words are easily understandable and they're not getting drowned out by music. Then as a final touch, I like to have it fade in and fade out. Now we've got two of three steps done, so it's time to finish up the video. With the editor, you can add animated text overlays with a bunch of different options for those in and out animations, as well as a few different style and font options. You can also choose image or video overlays from Riverside's built-in library, or you can upload your own, which is great if you're creating a presentation. Say you're talking about wind farms in this section of the video here. You can simply highlight that text over in the transcript, click add, then image, find the one that you like, and it'll be automatically placed over the portion of the video that you highlighted in the transcript. Finally, there's the all important captions tool. Everybody's using these these days. It's a great way to keep your viewers' attention, whether you're creating a long form podcast or just a short form video. And Riverside has an awesome tool to put those smooth animated captions over your content. Just go right over here to the right, hit captions, then select a starting style that looks good to you. From here, you can change the style, font, size, animation, and a bunch more to make the captions exactly how you want them to be. And just like that, you're done with your video. You can export it in up to 4K resolution and then share it for everybody to enjoy. I love how easy Riverside has made this process. I think it's a great tool for beginner editors who are a little bit intimidated or don't wanna deal with the headaches of a complex video editing software. Again, there's a link below for you to try it out for free. Let me know what you think. And if you wanna learn more video editing techniques, you should check out this video over here. I think that it'll be right up your alley.